Coach, with an inter-squad scrimmage today, what are your immediate thoughts, takeaways from today's practice? We got everybody's attention. We've had a good camp. Uh, really good today. Got them in some good situations between goal line, kicking, kill the clock, four minute, two minute drills. Uh, could have tackled a little bit better. Let, let a few tackles get out today. Offense made a couple more plays. Defense has been great. We've had a great week. We'll need these next four or five days. Classes are starting, getting a lot of polish leading into game week. But we come out of camp healthy. We come out of camp with a team that uh, is heading in the right direction. We just need to keep working and heading. We'll, we'll, we'll start with the uh, road test and a tough test and, and, a, and a strong challenge with Florida National. So we got to keep working. But I like the work and really good day. Weather outside, really good day today. Coach, how, at this stage, as you wrap up camp, begin to transition into game preparation, how do you grade what a successful fall camp is to get your guys where they need to be? Well, you got to me, when you, when you pop the pads as a football team, you got to reestablish how to tackle and block and, and the physical – what I call physical presence and body language of a good team. So you can lift and run, do all the training, but you got to you got you got to reestablish that. And because uh, you know, you know, even though you have player practices, they're not padded. You got to learn how to hit. And you also got to be smart. We've done a lot of hitting. We actually did a great job yesterday in our practice with a lot of hitting yesterday. Knowing that today last scrimmage be a little modified, so I kind of cheated yesterday and had a great go yesterday. So last two days have been awesome. And uh, again, I just I think we're building the toughness you need and the depth you need. And uh, we got a long way to go, but I like the way this team is moving. Coach, watching some of the, the scrimmage today, plenty of young guys, as we've seen all through camp, but guys like Cole Guest uh, on the offensive side of the ball, a lot of play. Just how much have they improved just being here on campus through this preseason camp? Well, we're deeper and you're going to need it. And right now you got a couple guys, nothing major. Again, the only injury of note today has been Jay Sean. You know, Rob McCray is going to lose those, those, the first half of the, of the season coming off his injury, four, five, six games. Same with Camion Patrick. Other than that, we got guys that uh, uh, we've had to be smart with some practice and contact. That, that being said, these freshmen have had to play. And I think today, uh, Ricky Jones, Mitchell Page didn't get a bunch of work today because we need Isaac James and we need Ricky Brookins and we need Nick Westbrook and we need Luke Timian and those guys to mature. So a lot of work today was with those young guys. It's nice to see Cole Guest. You saw Clyde Newton coming into running back doing well. It's nice to see those guys because I believe to be a good football team in the Big Ten and to be a good football team early, you need a lot of players. All right, Coach, thanks a lot. Thank you.